Consider the pictorial representation of a chemical change shown below. Using the smallest set of whole numbers, the coefficient of C2H2 in the balanced chemical equation for this reaction is A 1 B 2 C 3 or D 4. Let's examine the figure to see what molecules are being represented. According to the legend, a carbon atom is represented here by a filled circle, and a hydrogen atom is represented by a small unfilled circle. Therefore, this is a C2H2 molecule. We have three of these in the before picture, one, two, and three. In the after picture, we only have one left. This means that during the reaction, the amount of C2H2 decreases. C2H2 is being consumed. It is then a reactant. In the pictures, we lost two molecules of C2H2. What else do we have? According to the legend, large unfilled atoms are oxygen atoms. Therefore, these are O2 molecules. We have five of these before and none after the reaction. So O2 is also a reactant. The pictures show the loss of five O2 molecules during the reaction. Similarly, we should be able to identify CO2 as a product of this reaction. On the left, we have no CO2 molecules. On the right, we have four CO2 molecules shown. One, two, three, and four. Therefore, the picture shows the formation of four CO2 molecules. We should also be able to identify H2O molecules as a product in this reaction. There are no H2O molecules on the left, and there are two shown on the right. One and two. Therefore, the picture shows the formation of two H2O molecules. So one possible balanced equation for this reaction is 2C2H2 plus 5O2 yields 4CO2 plus 2H2O. The coefficients are 2, 5, 4, and 2. This is one of many ways of balancing the equation. We can multiply or divide all the coefficients by the same number and still have a balanced equation. For example, we can double all the coefficients and still have a balanced equation. In that case, the coefficients would be 4, 10, 8, and 4. Or we can divide all the coefficients by 2. We still have a balanced equation with a coefficient set of 1, 5 halves, 2, and 1. This question is specifically asking for the coefficient of C2H2 in the equation with the smallest set of whole number coefficients. The coefficients 2, 5, 4, and 2 are the smallest set of whole number coefficients. Why? Because their greatest common factor is 1. But 1, there is no number that you can use to divide all four coefficients to get a set of smaller whole numbers. Therefore, the correct answer is B. The coefficient of C2H2 is 2, provided we use the smallest set of whole number coefficients. Note that test makers are sometimes sloppy. If you see a question like this on a test, and it doesn't specifically specify the smallest set of coefficients, assume that it is applied.